Hello my YouTube friends. Snap Camera is an awesome tool that you can use to have fun with live audience. There are all sorts of different faces that you can choose from. And the best part is, it's totally free man. I'll show you how to use it today. So, let's get to it. My goal on this channel, honestly, is to help people with stuff that can be useful to them. And you can really help me out by letting me know how I'm doing down in the comments. And please don't forget to leave a thumbs up. This helps you to share this video with a wider audience. And if you're not subscribed, please do, this goes a long way towards helping me continue to make content that helps you. And it's totally free. Now you may think that something like this is really hard to do, but it's not, it's really easy. First, we're going to install the Snap Camera. This is the virtual AR and we're going to go to this page and click download. And it tells us a little bit of information about what you actually need to run this. So you can check this out. It's not super hard requirements or anything like that. You just have to check I agree and I am not a robot. And then you can download it for PC or Mac. In my case, I'm going to download it for PC. And there it is down to the bottom left. And I just click on it here down in the bottom left and it opens up. All I have to do is click next. And then next. You can put the shortcut on your desktop if you like. And just keep clicking next all the way through the install. And eventually, it's going to install for you. And once it's done, it'll switch over and you can click finish and it'll launch Snap Camera if you leave that checked. Now it's installed. Let's see how we use it in Snap Camera. The first thing we're going to do is click this little gear in the top right hand corner. We want to choose our camera. In my case, it's USB capture. We also want to choose our microphone and set our resolution up. If there is a choice here, sometimes there is, sometimes there isn't. Going to select my audio interface as USB capture as well. We can scroll down here and see these hotkeys and I'll go over that later. What I'm going to do is go ahead and click back and let's just poke around and take a look and see what these look like. Some of them are just little pieces of stuff that they put on your face. Some of them are actually faces, which is really, really cool. Some of them also even have extra actions. So there's a hotkey that you can use to perform those extra actions. Now we can click on any one of these and it loads up the filter. You can see the filters on the screen. There are hundreds of filters and you can even create your own. So I'm going to go into hotkeys and I'm going to make sure that my lens on and off key is set so that I can turn these lenses on and off just by clicking on the minus key. And most of them are actually created by other users, you can see some of them will actually put in a completely different background as well. You can see these work pretty well even when I turned my face all the way to the side. So you can go through here and you can select from all kinds of different ones. And once you pick out a couple that you actually want to use her like this alien one, it's pretty fun. And you can get some like this where you look like a talking potato or something. All you have to do is mouse over the filter that you like and click this little star button and that'll save it up here into the top left hand corner. Now, if I go up into the top left hand corner, it shows all my favorites saved up here and we're going to use that in conjunction with these hotkeys. And now all of our filters have hotkeys and that's exactly how you're going to set up Snap Camera. Now all we have to do is set it up in OBS. So to add this into OBS, we just go into our scene, we're going to click the plus, we're going to go to video capture device. We can call this one snap cam. Click OK. We'll drop this down and we'll select our snap camera. And there we go, we can see it. You're going to want to go ahead and select your audio device. However, you are going to be speaking into the microphone. In my case, it's going to be the USB capture. So there we go. So now we have our USB capture and we're in here. Now all we really have to do is use the hotkeys that we set up in our snap camera to change our faces. And there we go, we have our faces, we can just click it again to turn those faces off. And we can select other faces and even add voices. It's literally limitless, the number of things that you can do with this, you can add all kinds of faces and flip around to whichever ones you want at any time. 
You can create characters for your live streams and do all kinds of silly stuff and it's just as easy as adding in Snap Camera in OBS. What could be easier than that easy and fun? If you're always looking for stuff, tips and tricks that can help make you a better live streamer or YouTuber, subscribe to the channel. It's totally free. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one.